I feel really speechless speechless and really happy because it's been very different lately and she's been doing lots of hard work for me and my sister and she really deserves this award. I'm just absolutely overwhelmed and um, thank you so much to the people who made it happen so Sunny Varki, Varki, Varki Foundation, uh, Sheikh Mohammed um, who completely believe in, in the work that teachers do um, and at the end of the day you know it's all for these children here that we're doing it so it's just such an incredible and immense honour. Anything is possible and I think as you know my passion is with the arts and I really want to make sure that arts are celebrated in every school. Some of these children woke up at three o'clock in the morning just to come here. I mean that says it all for me. They are just so 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 dedicated and I'm just it's just wonderful. I actually love working with children and um, I think I'm good at it aren't I? She's understanding, like she's got hope in us and she always helps us go further. She always pushes us more. Um, I think that she's a nice, um, she's a great teacher and, um, and, and she's always like, help, um, she's always making other people laugh and like um, helping each other with everything. Um, I think she's a very good teacher because she thinks about the positives and never the negatives. I think she really stands out as an incredible classroom practitioner, fantastic teacher. You can see how motivated the students are, how excited they are to see her. They really want to get back into that classroom and, and learn with her. Uh, and that's, that's the motivation and passion that she brings to education. I think what we'd really like to do is to use it to, to really bring the arts out into the community and, um, and make it a big feature of the community and also bring the cultures. We've got a very mixed um, environment. We've got lots of different cultures. We'd like to bring them into the school and really make art a very big priority. And we also want to really work with our community to develop uh, literacy, numeracy, employability skills uh, and really help the community to move on and uh, to develop and become stronger and stronger.